hey guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here hi my name is Ruki. you're welcome if you're older than a returning subscriber you already know how we do it over here Mwah, i love you guys so much and that's on what period in today's video i felt like just you know going back to the old days recalling all the good memories yeah i placed an anonymous um question tag up i sent it to quite a number of people it's rather unfortunate i didn't send it quite early so i think a hundred or a ninety percent of the people are yet to see it maybe i'll just do a part two of this after i gather all the questions but i have 20 questions here and i think they were more than 20 but i just decided to select some because some were repeating questions yeah so without further ado let's just get right into the video so the first question says that which senior high school did you attend i attended um asante my senior high school in kumase specifically swami that's where i attended school nananom for real asas call it whatever the best school in gh you can bend the sea like i always say yeah we used to wear green the ladies ladies used to wear you know a dress green dress and the the guys used to wear green shorts and white shirts what do you regret in your high school life um one thing i regret so much is not like not studying so hard not studying more than i did when i was there if i would go back i think i would study even more than i used to do like even three times or four times or even ten times i like i used to do okay the fourth question says that how how was your relationship with your juniors i i wasn't i wasn't a a strict or you know those kind of strict seniors i wasn't one i was just a cool senior i wasn't really in good terms not like we were fighting but we we're just like roommates nothing else yeah the only people i used to vibe with and talk to and like joke with were my school daughters but aside that I wasn't really cool with them until I became a perfect. The fifth question says, what were your thoughts when you arrived at your at your school for the first time? I really underestimated the school when I first got there. Because, you know, if you know us and Simai, it's not a big school. It's just like a small school not really small but not that big as well so i was like this is just going to be boring there's nothing going to be going on and those kind of things but i was shocked when i went and it was all fun and even the teachers and all that they are very good i at least expected what i got when i went there the fifth question says what was what was the name of your high school bf really i knew this question was coming um what did you say <laughs> yeah yeah the person is curious so he said what's the name okay okay relax so i had a lot of boyfriends in high school in my definition of boyfriend i have i have so many boyfriends i didn't have please i didn't have <laughs> i didn't have i'm serious <laughs> so the next question says were you the entertainment type obviously not i wasn't the entertainment type i was those types 
if you are going for entertainment yeah i'm happy if you are not going for entertainment i'm still cool were you a brilliant student no i wasn't i wasn't i was an average student i guess yeah i was in my class I'll, i'm not gonna brag but in my class i was part of the best students yeah tell a short story that happened which you will never forget <laughs> my school mom was a jamsa um deputy wukong so when they were going she was like no one else is going to take it aside me it, honestly as at that time i was still a learner i did even now i'm still a learner i didn't know much about my religion and all that so i was kind of scared because i didn't know about it but she was like you can do it go for it come on and all that so i agreed sis picked the form and i filled the form and i took the form to the executives and it was time for interview now it was my turn then <laughs> relax then they called me in when they called me in, they were like hi salam alaikum i was like wa alaikum salam i'm here for the interview and they were all my seniors like i got in there and they were all my seniors they were all people i used to see every day started the interview what's your name i can't remember some of the questions but <laughs> if you know the story i'm sure you're already laughing your ass out because hey. <laughs> the question started and it was going on well till he asked what are your hobbies i can't remember but something similar to that okay sis went to say singing <laughs> see i'm so embarrassed like anytime i'm talking about this I feel so embarrassed. So they were like, oh, your hobbies are singing. And I was like, yeah. <laughs> and I like, can you sing for us? <laughs> I was like, yes. Hey. <laughs> so I think I think they asked me who was my favorite musician or something like that. And guess what? Since when to say if yeah. <laughs> Seriously. I said a fear with so much courage and strength. And I'm like, oh, a fear, really? So, can you sing for us? My dumb ass did not know it was a trap. My dumb ass started E F Y A. <laughs> Subhanallah. <laughs> so apparently some of them, some of the executives were calling me a fear behind my back. It was later I got to like I had it. I had it. I was hurt. <laughs> it was a mistake. I was immature. I was naive. I didn't know what I was saying. <laughs> so the next question says that what was your favorite dining meal jollof there was wachi yeah the meal i hated was rice and gas i hated that food with all my heart and my soul what food is that next question says which house were you in i was in house one it was called adishia house which means Mirefi, I've forgotten. I can't remember. I did share, I think, princesses or royals. Royals, yeah. We had the boys category too. So the boys also had house one and they were the Akatachi. Oh, I think so. For that one, I can't remember the meaning. The next question is Who was your favorite teacher? My favorite teacher was. In the beginning, it was my English teacher. He was called Kinobed. I learned he's very sick. I don't know what exactly is wrong with him, but information got to me that he's sick. 
I really pray for him. May Allah grant him Shifa. May Allah heal him of his distress and grant him ease. Amen. Yeah, so he was my favorite teacher. But later on, there was this physical education teacher who also came later. He was called Soja. I can't remember his real name. Yeah, so he became my favorite because he was a young boy cute and all that <laughs> um what course did you read and which class were you in i read general arts obviously with electives um economics government literature and asante tree the tree asante my tree is going ah what is tree i was in at seven we had at one up till at seven my class was the last class at seven a seven yeah the next question says did you hate any student or lecture or teacher um i didn't hate any student for the teachers i won't say hate but like the way they were you know, punishing us killing us beating us charlie it was my house master was one of the most i don't know should i say wicked hmm. he would slap you in eh? <laughs> so i wouldn't say hate but i just didn't like how he was and all that yeah and our house mistress to madame abiwa hey abiwe bo don't run and see the next question says did you did you hold any position i honestly didn't go for any position but i was later appointed as the house prefect assistant house prefect after our assistant house prefect stopped schooling the next question is i think you won an award what award was that i didn't win that award alone i won it with my friends it was best spouse category in the school awards yeah and it was only us so yeah we were five we had malaika we had um mom's kid we had m um, china we had Mevelyn and Benes. I don't know her M name because we all had this M in our name and we were called the I am Shakes. I don't even know what that name means. The next question says you were very religious. I used to see you go to the mosque to pray all the time. I wasn't even that was a point I was still like learning, like I said earlier on. As Antimai really taught me a lot. Before I went there, I didn't really have Muslim friends. So when I went there, um, I had the opportunity to meet a lot of Muslims because there were a lot of Muslims in the school. So I met a lot of Muslim Muslim friends, and they would, you know, if anytime you see them practicing, like it was just so beautiful. So I also just adopted that like putting on the veil yeah so yeah and our our mosque our mosque was at the boys d so i think this person is a boy and i think he they used to stand up there and when you are coming they'll be shouting your knee we are on the 18th question so did you did you ever scale a wall out or in of the school no i didn't that part that particular day i was supposed to scale the wall with my friends i wasn't in school i was home so they they actually came to me at home then it, it was late so when they were going they had to go and scale the wall so obviously if i was part of them i would have also scaled the wall <laughs> but i didn't i never ever 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 so i'm a good girl <laughs> your best experience in high school 
I was always given this DB treatment. Some way, somehow, I feel like people actually thought I was a DB. Okay, yes, probably. Yes, I was a DB, but like not at the point or like not as much as they, you know. That was because, you know, sometimes my dad will come to the school and he'll even come on weekend, weekday. We'll be in class and some teachers will come and they're like, Yakub Rukaya, your dad is at the headmaster's office. <laughs> He's calling you. <laughs> then I'll go, then he'll take me to his Nissan patrol or his Nissan pickup in white. Hey! <laughs> he'll give me you know money and then maybe some provisions and i'll take these provisions to class <laughs> oh my god yeah so like those moments were priceless because you know your dad is here even one time i was punished we 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 opened school but i skipped some number of days i skipped like seven days like that was a week so we went to school and our house master was like if you skipped a day you multiply it times two so i skipped seven days and that was 14 days to bring that number of brooms to school or you pay that amount so i called my mom and i told her everything then mama z <laughs> mama z chichiri chichiri wow, wow 14 brooms <laughs> and swore them in a Nizam patrol car and brought it to my camp, my school it to our house master and our house master was like hey hajia it's a 14 broom sitting now the car is here we are <laughs> i had this this treatment like it was the best like because most of the teachers knew i was thought i was a dbiyama like eh. Another um, best experience I had was um, going for interzonals, interschool games, and all that at stadium, meeting your friends from different schools. It was so fun. That was one of the periods I, or that was the best experiences I had too. Yeah, it was precious, you know. You sit down, you talk about your schools, you watch the games, you she jama <laughs> you she jama from your school to the stadium. It was fun. It was definitely fun. Yeah. Yeah. The last and final question. It's not even a question. He the person is like give an advice to senior high students with all everything you have experienced i would say that um the main reason why you are in school is to learn and then pass and make your grades like the teachers always say that's the main reason you guys who are still in school you guys should try your best studying is the first thing it is the first thing okay with all these being said, I'll bring this video to an end by saying thanks so much for watching. I really appreciate you guys' support and all that. Your comments are really appreciated. And please subscribe. Subscribe, 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 okay? And share okay if you share to someone and the person also shares 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 and the person also shares, the person also shares. it's gonna go far and it's gonna help me a lot so please share and thank you very much for watching i'll see you guys in probably a part two i don't know yet but if there are more questions i'll definitely answer them in a part two and i'll see you guys in another video bye